Lord Fu, you have a message from Ms. Midori Midorikawa. What? She says, I'll head straight to the spot. I see your pets like to go off and act on their own accord, huh? You trying to be funny? I'm going back to work. Miss Christelle, I'm leaving him to you. Damon! Son of a bitch. <sighs> The Underground Society series is so great. Miike's film is just blazing. Kitamura is so badass. Kitamura was totally an assassin. I can totally tell. He can't fool me. He's got the same eyes as you. We're colleagues. He definitely gives off the scent. I hella want to see the new entry in the series. Miike really gets his shit done. One of these days, man, he'll totally bring back Kitamura's Underground series. Oh, Shinjuku is so awesome! Shinjuku is like some kind of paradise. Paradise, huh? God damn, I want to check out Shinjuku sometime. Punk! Making me look like an idiot, huh? The number five ranked assassin is Midori Midorikawa. Occupation? Dark World Princess. Even the UAA International Intergalactic Intel Network does not know exactly who she is. Get all your yayas out, Travis. Welcome to the Garden of Insanity.
Y te ataque más. Kochi Sosoma. Where the hell are we? At school. A Japanese school, huh? I've seen places like this in Miike's movies about delinquents and stuff. This place is kinda scary. Yeah, like one missed call scary. Something feels off here. Yeah, super off. My name is Midori Midorikawa. I'm a cleaner. My little sister's name is Doremi Midorikawa. It's spelled like notes and pronounced Doremi. It's one of those weird names people give their kids these days. My house is near Midori Yama Studio. During my rebellious period, I wore lots of Kimidori green. I was disappointed in myself for not wearing my favorite color, red. I've been cursed by green, which is Midori in Japanese. There are so many things I hate about it, and I almost totally blamed my parents, but I just couldn't hold them accountable because I love mommy and daddy. There was someone else I loved even more. He led me down this path to becoming a cleaner. What sort of path, you ask? Where do I even start? Time and space have been distorted, so I can't really get things straight. But for starters, I'm gonna kill you, so I'd appreciate your cooperation. She disappeared. Where is she? Over here! I'll keep this fire right for you, okay? It's kind of like a sign or a marker. That's easy enough, right? Okay, are we all ready to go? Start the game. Shower! <laughs> 
death throw! Anti-gravity death force! Strawberry! Yeah. You're tough, Travis. So I guess you've heard about me, huh? My boyfriend knows a lot about you. He is always talking about you. That you're free-spirited and stupid and intelligent and dumb. But you're also a nice guy with a serious side, too. I feel like he's probably right. There's a certain type of guy that reminds me of my old boyfriend. Something happened and we ended up breaking up. But the reason for that was actually pretty funny. Want to hear about it? Um, no. I'm not really in the mood. Oh, it's about time we finish settling this. All right then, let's go up to the roof. Jump with me, okay? Yeah, that seems quickest. One, two, three! Huh? I messed up. This is... This is that rock quarry in Ibaragi that they used to film those tokusatsu shows, isn't it? Awesome! I can't believe I'm here. This is where they film Common Rider Zeo, you know? Oh, uh, sorry. I kinda can't deal with all this otaku talk, so could you not? Fine, whatever. I can fight all day here. All right, I'm not gonna hold back, okay? Wakey, wakey, it's morning. Huh? Morning already? I'm thirsty. I want some tea. <sighs> Sleepy. Still so sleepy. Listen, this mean, scary old man is standing right there. Let's kill him together. He's pretty tough. I might even die. No! Don't die! <sighs> no way! But I'm so sleepy. Nice. Changing forms like that and all? You must really love the tokusatsu stuff. Once these guys wake up, it's all over, Travis. Whatever. I'll kill all your asses. I gotta change up forms too. Otherwise, it would be rude. Pinchy! Right on. Oh. 
Fuckhead! No! Stop it! Right on! go. They're good kids. Are they twins? Probably. Okay, I'll let you have this one. Thank you. <laughs> Mommy! <laughs> I'll make sure you don't feel a thing. No! Who the hell are you? Trav, it's me. Kamui, is that you? Not this one! Stay out of this. That's my girlfriend! Seriously? This is your girlfriend? We've got no beef with you. We just sort of took Fu on his offer and, and, and thought of it kind of like going to a nice barbecue, you know? Like that thing that's really trendy these days. Dompering, or whatever. That was basically what we envisioned coming here. Are you for real? I've never actually met Fu. During the breakout, I made eye contact with him for like a second and I could feel the dark world in those eyes. Oh yeah, by the way, I'm a dark world princess. That's right, Midori is an actual princess. Isn't that awesome? Okay, so I kind of got no idea what's going on right now, but whatever. Since you're these little guys' mommy, I'll let my katana sleep for now. Thanks, Trav. H how can I return the favor? Come on over and hang out sometime. That's good enough for me. Trav. You really are a good guy. A bit too good of a guy, really. So then, what do you all think about this? This boss fight? It had become quite the confusing mess, but somewhere inside that confusing mess hid the truth. What is real? What is not? These are indeed questions for the ages, there is only one thing that is real. I am here in front of your very eyes. After crossing the river of life and death, find the place where the point and the line of everyday life intersect. I'll be waiting for you any time. Kill the life. Destroy the life. Erase the life. Once it's all gone, it's all over. No. It's not actually over yet. The true end is killing the past. I'll see you again in the past. Kamui Uehara will be waiting for you. What a peculiar guy, Kamui Uehara. Congratulations, Travis. You have been recognized as number five in the galactic rankings.
Don't keep yourself small.